What's up everybody, my name is Braskus, and welcome to Viscera Cleanup Detail Santa's Rampage! So it's about that time of year again and I'm getting in the mood for Christmassy stuff, but I didn't really have any decent Christmas games to play. So I picked this one. Plus, uh, admittedly, I also saw someone else play this on YouTube not that long ago, and they did not do well at it, and that bothers me. So I wanted to play Viscera Cleanup anyway, and I want to do it right. So, uh, we're going to do solo. Save file, I don't have one, so that's fine. Cleanup or speedrun cleanup's fine. There's only one place to go to. All right, I know what I'm doing. I've played the original Santa, uh, uh, not Santa's Rampage, the original cleanup detail before, so. All right. Janitor, age 27. Junior executive janitor. The tragic events that unfolded at this workshop must in no way deter you from performing your duties in a manner befitting the company's reputation. Your work here entails cleaning up the horrific aftermath of Mr. Claus's unfortunate breakdown. This includes the obvious slaughter and any broken items and so forth. Please conduct yourself appropriately, as this assignment will reflect upon your permanent record. Fail to follow company guidelines and regulations, uh, and you may find yourself without a job. Once your assignment is complete, the corporation will take ownership of the workshop and any remaining items and employees. Well, I wouldn't get too attached to any possibility of employees, but other than that, let's go. Oh, dear God. All right, for starters, we're gonna clean up the, oh, cool. Okay, hold on. I need a bin. Actually, what I really need to do is see what the damage is. All right, so we've got corpses freaking everywhere. This looks like it should be moved. Oh god, he hit elves in the floorboards. <laughs> okay. Um, that's very pretty present wrapping, at least. I don't know what's in any of these, but they're here. Kind of feel like I might need to dispose of them. Okay, so workshop's up here. It's not looking good. The hell? These are not very cheery pictures, Santa. Uh, okay, we've got Chuck Hurlington's eggnog, thick and slimy. Uh, it looks like it says mm, something or other with 100% pride and 100% foreign lager or something like that. I can't really read it. All right, what else we got? Bottles, broken bottles, more corp. Wow, you are chock full of knives. Oh, good. Dynamite. That's what you want, just hanging out. So I'm guessing he blew a hole through the wall. Probably using some of that aforementioned dynamite. Is that a gun? What the hell is he even packaging? Okay, so more elves. Ow. Oh, yeah, I think he speared one of the elves on the horns. Oh, God, he murdered the reindeer, too. Um, yeah, it's not looking good. Okay, I don't think I can go through here, so these are the rooms that need to be cleaned. All right. Time to start cleaning up this uh, nightmare before hell. Okay. I'm going to need a bin. Biohazard box. Put that right there, and we're going to start picking up the bodies. Oh, it's so gruesome. I'm sorry, Herbie, you're never going to be a dentist. Uh, what else we got? Is that shotgun shells? Man, St. Nick just lost his freaking mind. Ah, crap. Hate when I do that. Is there not a way to rotate this? I thought there was. Uh. Ah, there we are. That's what it is. Okay, so now that I've completely messed it up, let's refill it. Stick my elf corpses in there. Oh, come on. How'd I do this? No, it was, uh, that way. Get in there! Thank you. And this is why you, uh, put the corpses in the box before you start trying to mop it up. Because every time you touch one of these to something, it leaves a smooch.
Oh, I dropped it. It is a foot. Oh god, this poor little thing. Okay. Try not to think about it. Just put him in the box. He's at peace now. Winkle Snuffles. God rest you, merry soul. Or, gentlemen. God rest you, merry gentlemen. Because nothing can dismay you any longer. Uh, alrighty then. Another arm. Come on, give me a hand. Dump that in there. And then, uh, who's this? Trixie Pine Hat. Just put that in there and, um,. Okay, I can't pick up the police line or anything like that. Okay. Now, let's take this whole box. God, is it heavy. And don't tip it over. Just place it gent... Stupid chair is stuck on it, isn't it? Just put it in there. Let it burn. Put that down. Okay. That's a decent start. So, give me a bucket. I have to start somewhere, so I might as well start here. Oh my god, I forgot how bloody this mop gets and how quickly it does it. And it's already gonna need to be cleaned. Whoops. Ah! God damn it! <laughs> okay. Give me the bucket. And burn it. And then give me a new bucket. Now let's try this again. Let me clean up some of my footprints there. Try and uh, limit my overall gore spread factor here. Nope, too much. Now I do mean limit because of course, as soon as I walk anywhere in this place, it's gonna get bad again. But if I could kind of clean up the foyer, then at least I'll have one nice little place I can come back to that isn't a total, you know, gore fest. There we go. I think it's clean. Ah, good. Nope, that's just gonna make it worse. Okay, so pick up the bucket and burn it. Like everything else. Okay, now we're not stepping foot in there. Ah, okay, I can't listen to this anymore. I'm burning the boom box. I need a new uh, trash bin for all the bodies that are in here. There. Okay. We're good. Can I, like... Okay. There we go. Into the bucket with you. But let's be honest. Into the bucket with a lot of you. I just got an achievement called The Day the Funk Died. Presumably for uh, burning the boom box. Ah, oh, but it's so much quieter now. The boom box is really freaking loud. Okay, and let's uh, write you up and then drop you in there. Okay, good. How many more corpses do I need to, yep, here's another one. I don't know any of your names, 
Except for those of you whose thumb drives I find. Um, you're not in there very securely. Can I, uh, put you in there a little b Oh, God. I didn't notice the one stapled in the rafters. Okay, I'm just gonna try and burn this and try not to, uh, knock him out of it. God damn it. <laughs> Come on, rotate it up. Oh, it's so hard to rotate this thing. Okay. There. Burn this one as it is. You know what? I'll just throw more elf corpse in here. It's already on fire, right? Yeah, who needs the waistband or waste bucket when I can just drop them in there? I mean, it's all right here. We got more broken bottle bits, and we got just all kinds of bad stuff. Hey, he's kind of cool looking. Um, here's another dead elf. We can put you in the fire. It'll all be over soon. Um, here's another full elf. Maybe I just need to put the full elves directly in the fire and use the waste bins for the elf bits. That seems like a good way to do it. Okay, let's make an elf bits bin. Here's elf bits. Do I need to... Yeah, probably. Let's just haul it out here a bit. There we go. Uh, Impy Tinky Toes, I think is what that says. You know, some of you could have made a good job in the entertainment industry with names like these. Okay, there's another one down. Who's next? Uh-huh. And he goes. Who's next? Uh, this is Perkin Snotzel. Ew, you're probably not very popular. I don't think I want to be holding on to that anymore. And then that goes in there. I dropped an arm. Stokey Piddlefinger? I wanted the arm. Thank you. Is there any more elf pieces over here? Yep, there's another arm right there. And we'll just put that in there. Put that in there. How am I going to get the elf off of the rafters? Oh, just like that. Okay. There you go. <laughs> Joy to the world. Um. Okay, are there any more elf pieces lying around on the floor somewhere? Sticky honey toes. You also sound like a very unpleasant person to spend time with. Um, I see dolls, some Chuck What's-His-Face eggnog bottles, which I'm just going to drop in there because they're gross and I don't think they need to stay. Ugh. Dump that. Um, that is dynamite. I feel like maybe I shouldn't dispose of that in the uh, waste bin or the fireplace. Shorty Tickler. All right, let's uh, burn this one. Are there any other elves around here? I don't think so. Oh, there's a flash drive. Waxy Big Fist. I guess we got some shotgun casings. Can probably toss those. Sappy Littleton. I'm gonna burn this present. Just kind of lying there. Figgy Faffler. More shotgun casings. Uh, another one over here. Okay, I think it's time we start mopping again. Ooh. There's so much badness around this thing. Okay. Um, start by cleaning the mop, I guess. Oops. Okay. I 
I'm gonna try and like limit my own Ooh, be careful footsteps as much as possible so I my, my goal here is to sort of make a clean pathway between me and where I'm trying to get to and pray to God I don't knock over the bucket okay and now I'm gonna need another bucket Because that other one's already getting pretty gross. My god, I tracked footprints everywhere. Nope, not that one. Put it in that one. Thank you. I made more gross. Okay. Clean it. Fix the gross. Scrub it away until I'm as clean as the room. Uh. Huh, thought I'd burn that bottle. Apparently not well enough. Well, I'll get to it in a minute. Eek. There we go. And water. Okay, both of these now need to be burned, so let's uh, start burning some buckets. Burn that bottle. And then burn this bucket too. Apparently I just got the fireplace bloody. Don't fully know how that's possible. Don't care. Mop it. Makes me feel so much better to clean up the footprints and actually see floor through all of the cake gore. Um. Okay, any more? I'm probably gonna start smearing more blood around. Clean. Never mind the uh, knife blade. I'm sure I won't trip on it or impale myself. I'll throw it in the fire in a minute. Like any responsible person. And when I get to that other workshop, I'll probably start uh, throwing fire orbs in the fireplace too. <laughs> okay. Have I gotten most of the gore? Is there gore up there? Yeah, of course there's gore up there. Which I'm gonna have to get up here to get to. Okay, rafters are clean. That's nice. Could start working my way up the stairs, I guess. Okay, that bucket is now covered in blood. Torch it. And clean the fireplace. Apparently I knocked over Santa's hat. What is this? Oh, it's a flash drive I didn't burn appropriately. Ah, well, burn the hat. It's tainted now anyway. With the sins of the- Hey! No, no god damn it. You just muckety-mucked my nice clean floor. Twice! You muckety-mucked my clean floor again! Okay, better. Knit. Uh, oh god, right. Okay, over here then. <laughs> Trying so hard not to keep tracking footprints all over the place. Have I cleaned the gore out of this room? Well, almost. I guess not quite here. Oops. Should take this bucket over there. It's where I'm gonna need it. Uh, 
And of course, we're back to this old dilemma of uh, we have elf pieces that need to be disposed of. It's the one stuck to the wall that's the worst. Oh, man. Ugh. I should probably just get another one of those uh, bins. But I don't know that that's a good idea either. And you know what? I think it's time for a little bit of experimentation. Um, so I'm going to get rid of the bin. But I kind of want to get rid of everything that's dangerous. So, here's what we're going to do. Dynamite stick. And dynamite stick. How many more of those? Weren't there like four of them? Um, I only see those two. Oh, wait, here's one. And then there was some knives. Those need to go in there. And I remember there was... Oh, I'm going to track more gore around, aren't I? If I'm not careful. We'll just give the mess as wide a berth as possible while I pick these up. Oh my god, there's gore everywhere. Or dynamite everywhere. Look at that. There's like three more sticks in there, too. I should just pick this up and move it over here, because it's going to be closer. I don't feel better about the clinking of the knife. TNT. Just put that in there. And then there was like three more sticks of dynamite. It really is a pity I can't hold more than one of these at a time. Okay, there's one. Uh, please try not to track very much gore. Dear Mr. S. Claus invoice, total for this month comes to toys and other play. I, oh my god, he owes six million dollars? Five million, 5.4 million in electronic devices. Urgent, final notice, Mr. Santa Claus. Okay, so it's no wonder he freaking lost his mind. Although I still don't know what the elves had to do with it. Except that I guess they were just the unfortunate targets of his anger. It was bad. Mr. Claus needed to go through anger therapy. His bowl full of jelly had uh, lost quite a lot of its uh, bounce. Okay, now there's also these. I'm going to track some more gore in here, aren't I? I probably just did. Yep, I certainly did. Damn it. See, I don't know which ones of these are toys and which ones of these are not. This one does not look like a toy. Ow. Okay. Are there any other more insanely dangerous sticks of dynamite or murder weapons or anything that I need to worry about? Hmm, well that might be. Oh, forget it. Just dump it in there. Okay, I think that's all the dangerous stuff I can think of to burn right now. Looks like a Nerf gun. Did you get killed by Nerf gun? Okay. Here we go. Our box of explosives. Fire in the hole. Oh my god. <laughs> um... Well, the fire's still burning. That's a good sign.
I don't necessarily feel good about this. And I think I just undid most of my cleanup work. Um, yeah. Pretty sure I just undid most of my cleanup work. Alright, well, you guys get the gist of it. This is a fun little diversion. I enjoy this game, and uh, Merry Christmas to all. But uh, I'm going to be at this for hours if I try to actually clean it all. So, I guess we'll just call it here. Anyway, thanks for humoring me on this little diversion, guys. I'm just going to keep burning presents. And anyway, if you enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button. Feel free to leave a comment down in the section below. And as always, guys, I'll see everyone in the next episode. Catch you guys later.